or even in federal prison. You see this? No monkey business. This nigga think he above the law, even in federal prison. Even in federal prison, he think he above the law. But we gonna show you. Three minutes, y'all. Three minutes and counting, and we making phone calls to the MDC of Brooklyn, New York, the Eastern District, Kings County. Kings County, y'all. Uh, three more minutes. Three more minutes, man, and we making our phone calls. Three more minutes, and we making them phone calls. Feel free to hit the Twitter and support the content. Feel free to hit the cash app. Feel free to hit the cash app because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you how to put a nigga in the box today. You want to see how to take a nigga visitation rights? You want to see how to take someone's phone call rights? <laughs> I'm what? taking. I'm about to show you how to take a nigga rights real quick. I think P. Diddy thought it was sweet yesterday. This is my birthday present to Sean Combs, y'all. This is my birthday present to Sean Combs. Happy birthday, P. Diddy. This is my birthday present to you. Two more minutes, y'all. This is my birthday present to Sean Combs, y'all. This is my birthday present. I'm about to give Sean Combs a birthday present from Gangster Land. This is from the this is from the Cap Gang. We Cap Gang is about to give Sean Combs a birthday present. Fuck he thought this was. Hey, what he what he thought this was. He thought he could manipulate the system. He thought he could do what he want from jail. Nigga, who you think you is a crime boss? Nigga, what? Nigga, I'm about to show you. Let me teach this nigga something. Let me teach him something. You know, because I do this. It's, you know, I'm used to talking to the feds. This ain't the first time I talk to the feds. I'm used to calling the feds on niggas. That's crazy work. Nigga, I, I, me and the feds have, like, me, like, I told people, I work for Crime Stoppers, man. I'm a civilian. I work for Crime Stoppers. <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> I work for Crime Stoppers. This, yeah, happy birthday to Diddy from Gangsta Land, y'all. Two more minutes, man. Two more minutes. We're going to get them niggas some time to get to the desk. I was going to say it's 11 o'clock. Yeah, you know they run on black colored people time. Colored people time. You know, this is Brooklyn. This is uh, Brooklyn. Let's, let's give them two minutes. Two minutes to get to the desk. Cap, <laughs> <laughs> you a whole mark out here, dog. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this should be too funny, dog. This shit about to be real funny. Uh, cap your mark, man. That shit too funny. He said we. He said we gonna we call them. Nah, nah. They just open up at twelve, Lena. They just open up at twelve. It's not lunchtime. They just open up at twelve. Look on their website. On the website, they say they open at twelve o'clock. They, they oh, the phone lines open at 12. Now you know Cap did his research. Hell yeah, I did my research. The phone lines open at 12 o'clock. 12 o'clock. 12 a motherfucking clock. We we about to, we about to make our phone call right about now. That motherfucker jumped to 45 all of a sudden, boy. Huh? Hey, I hit the Y'all hit that like and subscribe button, man, while y'all here, man. You know, they like when I make them phone calls. You see that, right? They know when I make them phone calls. They know what time it is. Oh, no. It ran up like a motherfucker. It went from... Because when I posted it, when I posted on Facebook, it went from 20 to 30. Now, it went from 30 to 45. I mean, just that quick. Watch. Hey, Victoria. It's about to get ugly, Victoria. I shared a lot. Share the lie. It's 33 people in here. Share the lie. We about to call the federal penitentiary on Diddy. Diddy is about to go to solitary. Tell them niggas, Gangsta Cat about to put Diddy in solitary. 
Hey, it's 33 people watching, 21 likes. That math ain't mathing, man. Y'all hit the like button. We about to put Diddy in solitary, y'all. 42 people in here. Diddy, everybody share that line. Diddy about to go to solitary. Diddy is about to lose his phone privileges. Phone privileges. I, I swear to God on my kid's grave. I swear to God on my kid's grave, he about to lose his phone privileges today on my kid's life. I promise y'all, everything I love. He violated the law and I got it. And y'all know I got it. I don't play. I don't play. Level three. I got all the info. Mm -hmm. Yeah, did he go into the hole? Did he go into the hole today, y'all? We're going to make sure of this. 51 people in here share the motherfucking lie. 51 people in here share the lie. We about to call MDC Brooklyn. Diddy is about to go to the fucking hole. We about to put Sean Combs in the hole where he belong. He violated a federal law and made a three-way call from prison. P. Diddy made a three-way call from prison. Sean Combs, A.K. Love, made a three-way call from prison, and we are reporting it today. Buddy Love. Yeah, Buddy Love. This nigga want to be like Eddie Murphy and call himself Buddy Love. Watch this. We're going to see how much he like this hole. Yeah, we're going to see how much he like this hole, y'all. We're going to see how much he like this hole, y'all. We're not playing with this nigga. <laughs> this, nigga, this ain't no game. Nigga, I ain't playing no games with this nigga today. Y'all ready? Let's do it. Y'all ready? Can, can we get a cash app? Yeah. Can we get a motherfucking cash app? Can we get a cash app? Support a nigga for the cash app. We got 47 people in the building. Can we hit that cash app and support the motherfucking lie? Because when I tell you I make content, this is content. I'm going to show you how to break a nigga down. I'm going to show you how to break a nigga down even when he in jail. You want to see how to make a nigga cry when he in jail? I'm going to show you how to make a nigga cry while he in jail. See, these other niggas don't know how to break a nigga. I know how to break a nigga. The way, the way to break a nigga is make them lose connection to their family. The way to break a nigga is to make a nigga lose every... I know what you love, my nigga. I know what you love. You love seeing your family. You love talking to your kids, my nigga. I, I know how to break you. I know how to break you, my nigga. <laughs> Happy birthday, Daddy. Happy birthday, Happy birthday, Happy birthday, to Daddy. Happy birthday, to <laughs> we love y'all. I love y'all so much. We love, love you, you too. too. Love you, Pastor. Okay, so I can't wait to see y'all. Yeah. Can't wait to see y'all. I'm just want to say I'm proud of y'all. Proud of y'all, especially the girls. I mean, all of y'all. Just for being strong. Thank y'all for being strong, and thank y'all for being by mm -hmm. my side and supporting me. I love y'all. I got the best family in the world. My birthday. I'm happy. Thanks to y'all giving me this call. Thank you very much. I love y'all. We love you, love you too. Can't so wait to see you, see you in a couple of days. I'll see you in a couple of days. Say it again. Say it again. I love you too, baby. <laughs> 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 she, yo, 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 Pops. Hi, we're right here. Chance right here on the phone, too. Pops, uh, love eating all your cake, so you're not going to have none left. <laughs> She's literally digging <laughs> her face in there. Yeah, you're going to have to buy you a new one. <laughs> yo, she's face down in the cake right now. <laughs> Say hey, Chance. Happy birthday to my. We love you. Ch Chance is right here too. If you can hear on the phone, one more time. Hey, Chance. Happy 
Y'all see that? Y'all see that? That's called three-way call. In a federal prison, you are not allowed to do calls like that. You are not allowed to call and talk to another person on another phone. Phone to phone is not allowed in prison. That is called three-way calling. It is illegal. They tell you when you first make a phone call, you're not allowed to do three-way calls. Your boy P. Diddy just violated a federal law in prison. I'm about to get that motherfucker phone privilege taken away. That motherfucker about to lose his phone privileges right now, y'all. We about to take them phone privileges right now. I just wanted to show y'all what we doing. Your boy on a three-way call with Chance. I don't give a fuck who Chance is. His uncle, his son, he violating a federal law on a three-way call. Watch this, y'all. Niggas think it's a game. Niggas, y'all niggas think it's a game. Y'all see this? They think it's a game, no monkey business. I'm here. They think this shit is a game, y'all. This shit ain't no game. They about to learn. Y'all about to learn today. Y'all think this shit a game. This shit ain't no game, man. Yeah, we about to put him in the hole. He going to the hole today, y'all. Nah, he going to the hole. I guarantee you he going to the hole today. We putting that nigga in the hole. Hello, you reached the Metropolitan Detention Center in Brooklyn, New York. This calls in reference to an inmate. Dial zero or remain on the line. If you know your party's extension, you may dial it now. Thank you. Oh, shit. I think somebody answered. My bad. Somebody answered. Damn, somebody answered right when you hung up. Yep. Hello. You reached the Metropolitan Detention Center. In D.C. Brooklyn. This is Paul Robert Sammy. How, how you doing? You said your name is what? Uh, that is just calling reference to an inmate. Uh, oh, yes, yes, it is. I would like to re, uh, report an uh, incident pertaining to an inmate. Pertaining to a what? I would like to report an incident pertaining to the uh, inmate. Uh, what kind of incident? Uh, a violation. I uh, was the inmate violated. Yes, the inmate violated violated one of your rules. He violated one of the rules. Yeah. Oh. Yes, he's. He, All right, what, what, what room did he violate, and where this occurred at? Uh, he, he's he's making three way calls. He's actually oh, making three way oh, calls. Currently in, in prison, made a three way call. Yeah, he, he's making that's three way calls. About? Yeah, that's what I'm calling about. Uh, oh, what's the name of the inmate, man? Man, his name is Sean Combs. He made a three way call. Yeah, it's it's. When he made this call. Uh, he made it yesterday. It's on Instagram. It's live on Instagram, and he's in, in, he, in the call was to you. And nah, it's to other people. Three way call, and it's live on video. And I, I got the video that I want to email and send to you also, so you could. Yeah, All right, what you can do? Go to bop.gov. I, I got that already. I already sent the email. I sent the email. All right, so then, then that's it. You did your job. Okay, so but email. but so I don't have to report it also. I also uh, have I also have to report to make a report. Email, right? You yeah. got it. All right. Which, who am I speaking with? Officer Ross. Officer Ross. Yeah. All right. 
And, and, you, and what department are you in? I'm a correction officer, sir. Thanks for your cooperation. Oh, and you're a correction officer? Can you, uh, can you uh, send me to another department, please? Oh, I can't send you to another department. What is your name? <laughs> my name is Keith. What's your name? My name is Keith. Keith what? I don't have to give you my last name. I ain't said you had to. I just asked, right? Yeah, no. I'm, I, can you pass me to another department, Officer Ross? But you want to like fully cooperate. Can, can you sit? Can, 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 can you? Can you? Can you? Can you pass me? Yeah, pass me to another department. I'm not playing with you, Officer Ross. Who you think you playing with? Who always? I was surrounded like him, Puffy, friends. Yeah. Somebody paying this nigga. Yeah, I think them niggas was friends. He sound offended. I'm not hanging up, Officer Ross. You going to pass me to somebody with some authority. Are we, are we going to file a complaint on you? I would hate to have to file a complaint on you, Officer Ross, because everything I do is recorded. I wouldn't hang up. I'm not hanging up. Everything I do is recorded. I, nigga, I get Officer Ross in trouble, too. Officer Ross sound like they're friends. Hello, how you doing? Good. Uh, I can help you. Uh, may I ask who I'm speaking with? Well, uh, who am I speaking with? You're speaking to the investigation department. How can I help you? Oh, this is the investigation department. How you doing, sir? Uh, my name is Keith, and your name is? Yeah, oh, you know, give me a second. Hold on, just one second. Saying exactly like they as soon, soon as you ask for that name, yeah, you better put somebody on who, who really tell the truth. Let's not play no games. We put niggas in the hole today. Huh? Yes. Hello? How can I help you? How you doing, ma'am? My name is Keith. Who am I speaking with? Keith, this is the investigation department. How may I help you? Oh, how you doing? Um, I'm I'm calling because I'm trying to file a report on someone who's making three-way calls and it's being recorded on the internet. Who's the person? Uh, Sean Combs. Okay. And he's making three-way calls? Yes, it, like, and I got the video too. It's all over the internet, and like, I'm okay. I'm, I'm not trying to like call to be funny, but I just know making three way calls from a federal institution is illegal. Okay, thank you. I'll handle it. And so, and and the call took place last night. Okay, thank you. And, I will handle it. And what's your name? I need to I need to I need to know who I'm speaking with because I take reports of everything I do. I'm a journalist. Sir, I will handle it. No, that's not that's not how this works. I'm gonna call back and speak to somebody else then. I have this recorded. You have a good day. And that's no, that's not fine. that's not how this works. Who am who am I speaking with? I will handle it. You, okay? Who am I no who am I speaking with? I'm asking who are you, the investigation person. No, that's not how this works. Okay, we'll call back. We'll call back and speak to somebody else. Who the fuck you think you is? Watch hey this. man, that nigga, that nigga, that nigga got them. No, people watch on, this. Them people on the payroll, boy. You see how they don't want you, as soon as you say that nigga name, they 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 only dial zero or remain on the line. If you know your part is extension, you may dial it now. Thank you. You people paid off, boy. Now watch this. Hold on.
Yeah, that's what we're going to do next. We're going to call the DA. We're going to call the DA. How you doing? I'm trying to get in touch with uh, 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 an in investigation unit, somebody of authority. Can we just transfer you to that, sir? Man, man, that person act like they can't handle business. I don't know if they acting like they unprofessional, but they don't want to give the name of who they are, who I'm speaking with, and I'm telling them I'm a journalist and everything I say is recorded. That's a problem. You're a journalist. I suggest you. I'm gonna give you an email. You notify. I got the. I, that, I've already did the email. But if I'm talking to someone just like you gave me my your name when I spoke to you, so I have a reference of who I'm speaking with. The female that I just spoke with was very unprofessional sir, and didn't really want to give her name. Hold on, sir. The thing is, we don't deal with the press. So you have to, that's the only person that deals with the press. What you mean? Uh, yeah. But but if I'm but she's she's she she's a, a member of the public. She worked for the public. She's a correctional officer. What are you talking about? Hey, but again, uh, her job is to give her name. If I'm talking to her right. on the phone, her job is to give her name. One, stop yelling at me. I'm never okay. yelled one stop, time. Stop, stop yelling. Stop yelling. Lower your voice. Remain calm. And listen, we do not deal with the press, sir. So I understand what you're trying to do. But however, we do not deal with you guys. You understand? That, that person that you email, he will have to get back to you. You understand me? That's our procedure. But but so she's not her procedure also is to give her name. Well, what does it say that? What does it say that? What, do, what do you mean? You, what do you mean? You, you work when you, you called before. When you called before, you only gave your first name, right? You didn't want to give your last name, right? I gave my first know, name. I didn't ask for her last name. I didn't ask for her last name. All I asked was who. I didn't. No, nah, I didn't ask for her last name. I asked was her name, so I know who I'm speaking with. Okay, but that's the thing. Like I said, we're not supposed to deal with the press, sir. Only that the executive assistant deals with the press. I'm just saying, it, it just seemed unprofessional when somebody's really calling and they have a problem and they really trying to give a, a situation and, and this is the feedback you get. I'm like, wow. Yeah, but I, again, like I said, we do not deal with the press, sir. Once you give that up, it's over. We, we cannot deal with you, sir. So you just have to be patient. He'll get back to you with that email. Just email him all that information you have. So, so, so you, you deal with the inmates, right? Yeah. Sir, what, what, are the, what are the questions you have now, sir? No, I was asking you. I just asked you a question. I said, you, of course, you, you of course, because come on, what kind of question is that? Well, what I'm telling you, we do not deal with the press. You just identified yourself as press. Yes or no? Sir? I, I identify myself as a journalist, independent journalist. Right. So a journalist is a what? What, what does the journalist work for, sir? The press, right? You, you don't work for you, you don't work for the press because I'm an independent all right, all right, journalist. All right, okay, all right. All I right. just say I'm an, and I don't work for nobody. Right, I don't work for I don't work for nobody. Yeah, we're gonna call the DA office. We're gonna call the DA office. That's what we're gonna do, y'all. We're gonna call the DA office. Hey, them niggas, all them niggas work for they all on Diddy payroll. They... Yeah, we know how to do this. And they are professionals. The all district of New York District she, Attorney's Office. Not only did she not tell you her name, she hung up in your face. Not, oh, yeah, but look, it's all recorded, though. Like I said, it's all recorded. U.S. Attorney's Office, Eastern District of New York. It's all recorded. Look, it, look, look, baby, it's all recorded. Hey, you send this shit to TMZ, dog. They're going to blow up. This is this, what people don't understand. It's all recorded. All recorded. This will go to TMZ. Oh, I'm, it's going everywhere. We about to send it to everywhere. That's, that's crazy. They hung up. She didn't even tell you her first name. She just hung up. Because they all working for him. Now right. we, now we, we, they don't even know we really got an investigation now, because right. if they don't do something about it, that's even worse. They don't see, they don't know who they, who they dealing with. I think I'm about to call the district attorney office. They must not know who they dealing with.
Watch this. You have reached the U.S. Attorney's Office for the Eastern District of New York. The switchboard is currently unavailable. If you know your party's direct number, please dial one in the last four digits of that number now. To dial by name, please press two. If this is a law enforcement intake matter or other official emergency, please press zero now. Thank you. Intake boy. Is busy and cannot take your call. Please leave a message after the tone. Press the pound key to end recording. All right, we call them back. We gonna call them back. We gonna give them a minute. They said they busy right now. We gonna give them a minute. They must not know who they fucking with, y'all. Nigga, we call. We, nigga, we don't just call a prison. We call the district attorney, nigga. N nigga, these niggas must not know who they fucking with, y'all. We don't just call a prison, nigga. We call the district attorney. Hey, them niggas in New York, they, they don't give a damn, boy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's easy It's easy to pay off a New York nigga. New York it's nigga. easy to pay off a New York nigga. But they don't, they don't got no clue who they fucking with. This gangster cat, nigga. Yeah, fuck what you talking about, Keith. See, see they think they think they could, I'm just going to end it at them. That's what they think. Oh, you made an email, right? Oh, they think it's just going to end at that. No, nigga, I go way further than that, nigga. I go way further than that, nigga. Nigga, I go way further than that. These niggas have no clue. They don't know, have no clue who they fucking with. Nigga, we calling district attorney. Nigga, we call, nigga, we call the motherfucker. We call the motherfucking governor, nigga. Nigga, we calling everybody. Nigga, watch. Got me one. All recorded, nigga. And that's why they didn't want to get their motherfucking names, because they knew their ass would be got too. But guess what? I got the time of every, I got the time of when I called, nigga. We for you, we for you in them records. So guess what we doing? We calling back and for you in them calls. I called at 11.05. 11.05, we going for you that phone call. Freedom of Information Act, that phone call. We're going to freedom of information at that phone call. And we're going to make them tell us who we was talking to. We're going to make them tell us who we was talking to. And we're going to file a complaint on that motherfucker. <laughs> nigga, my nigga, we calling the governor. Nigga, we calling everybody today, my nigga. Nigga, we calling everybody today. P. Diddy taking his ass to the box. P. Diddy Kyle going ja to the box, nigga. You got Kyle Ja Rule next. See what he think about this. We, we got 60 people up in this motherfucker. Shit a lot. We, we, we putting that nigga in the box. Y'all niggas calling New York and ain't Kyle Ja Rule's ass what he think about this? Hey, hey, talk to him real quick. I got to use the bathroom. Talk to him. Hold it down. I got you, man. Hey man, this nigga Cap, bro, he don't give a damn. He gonna get to the bottom of this. I usually don't condone calling the police about anything, but this, I don't like Diddy. And this shit funny. I ain't gonna lie though, if Cap don't blow up off of this, I don't know what, I don't know what this nigga gotta do. But you really got a situation going though. Everybody hung up on him. That was the most unprofessional shit I ever seen, man. That shit was unprofessional. He didn't even ask what's her last name. He just said, "Who is he speaking to?" She she said she ain't have to tell him. Now if he have did the same shit, she'd have hung up on him anyway. He said his name. She didn't want to say her name. What kind of shit is that? She didn't even know he was pressed. Only person I really knew he was pressed was the first dude, the CEO dude. He never really even identified himself as press at first. He just asked who she was. I like damn. Yeah, Cap got run with this one. If this shit don't make 
this is to make something because like how like I don't know, bro. I, I everybody reading the comments, everybody heard what happened. Yeah, now nah, they disrespectful up there up north. I already know that's how they get down, but shit, that still don't mean that ain't nothing gonna, shouldn't happen about it. I just feel like I don't know, man. We're gonna see how this play out. You know, Cap gonna 